to get ready to go back, retailers have been preparing for months to ensure they're well stocked with essential items that families and students will need for the school year, Matt. Yeah, you might be noticing that the prices on things that you're having to buy to get everybody back to school, that's all adding up pretty quickly, maybe even faster than you're used to. That's why our Kelly Hubbard talked to financial experts, explains a little bit about how we might be able to save here and there for that back to school purchase. It's all going to add up somewhere. Kelly, good morning. They are, and good morning to you, Matt. Back to school spending is expected to hit $42 billion this year. That's up from the $37 billion reported last year. So this is all from the National Retail Federation. Experts say the average back to school spending for families is about $890 this school year, more than $1,300 for college students. So, regardless of what you're shopping for, the financial expert we talked to explains so ways to save. He says, to find deals where you can and don't forget to shop online and look for buying alternative brands. Try the dollar store. He says they can help you save on things like paper, pencils, poster boards and erasers. Another thing to consider, buy in bulk so you can restock later in the year. He explains more ways to save coming up this year. You can do that starting now. Just like when you're looking to put money into savings or pay off debt, really important to figure out where you can cut costs in your budget temporarily to put back towards your back to school shopping. So I always remind people of things like unused subscriptions for streaming services. If there's a show you're not watching right now and you're still paying for it, cut those off for a few months, put that money back in your budget. Parents may take a harder hit at the checkout line this year when paying for their children's back to school supplies, all depending on what you buy, of course. But these are some good things to keep in mind as you start off the school year. We'll have a full link to the study on our Nine News app if you want to check it out over there. Liz. Lots of important things to keep in mind while budgeting. Kelly, thank you.